that we're gonna do a, another super, super shitty, super shitty game, super shitty game, uh, called Raven Sword Shadowlands. I think it's a port from a phone or something. And we're gonna go with that now instead. I mean, not instead. But. Holy! <laughs> it already doesn't look. If this is doesn't if this captures game at all. Oh, I think the game crashed. Well it is it is a Kickstarter game. So you can't really expect it to be that good. You know? Why won't you let me play this crappy game then? Well, let's see. Resolution. It's proper resolution. Quality high. Full screen mode. Does it capture? It does capture. Yeah, uh, by the way, this isn't just me not being able to. Oh. Do this properly. This is actually what it looks like for me to like this little screen. <sighs> I hope it gets better. Two <clears throat> distance, sure. Volume difficulty. I I'll let the difficulty be where they actually. And this, I played a little bit of this game, like the very, 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 very start of this game, and it's really bad. It's really bad. <sighs> Let's go! After the fall of Ravenguard, the world tumbled into chaos. Raven's sword was lost, and dark times began. The dark elven invaders attacked human settlements throughout the kingdom of Tyrius. For centuries, the Great War raged across the Northlands. At last, the Dark Elves retreated to their greatest stronghold, the fortress at Herenmar. Seeking victory, the Archmage called upon all able warriors to join the human forces and march to the final battle. Ready your blade, lads. To battle! Glory for Tyrius! Yeah! 
camera sensitivity up, 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 way up. Even more up, please. Up as it goes. Those who took the field, human and elf, died that dark day. All save one. I bet that's me. Enough, Perdis. We must let him rest. I will watch over him. This game is supposed to be like 10 hours long or something like that. Easy now, there's nothing to fear. You're back in Avon, safe and sound. Get yourself cleaned up, then you can go and see Perdis. He's been waiting for you to wake. I guess this is me. Why does he have a line in the middle of his face? Yeah, I'll, I'll stick with this one, thank you very much. Holy sh- Holy beard. No, no thank you. That's more red than brown, you know? Not that I'm dating you. Yeah. What is this face then? Oh! Uh! <clears throat> this changes everything! I wanna go with this guy, he's a bit... Shadowlands. How did I get here? We brought you here after the battle of Heronmar. We were hoping you could tell us what happened out there. People say a dark fire appeared in the sky and then the battlefield went silent. You are the only living person found. Everyone else perished. Why me? That's what everyone wants to know. How did you survive when everyone else did not? And what caused the dark magic that appeared in the sky? Uh, who are you? My name is Lena. I am the spy master for our guild, the Champions of Tyrius. And you are our newest member. My task to gather information from the citizens of Avon, from the lowliest beggar to the wealthiest merchant. I didn't accept- I didn't ask for this. It's Perdis. Perdis is- Perdis is the guild master of the Champions of Tyrius, and a loyal friend. He is eager to speak with you. 
tell me more about the guild. We are a guild dedicated to preserving the kingdom and protecting its people. The guild once had over a hundred members, but the war changed all of that. After the battle at Heronmar, only myself and Tardis remained. Now we have you as well. Okay. Bye! Oh, we so pretty. Got no weapons, we got no armor, we got bread. Attribute points. Uh, I think I will go with melee. So, increase attribute. Thank you. We are neutral. Learner. I guess fast learner is something you always want to go with. I mean, getting more experience points just sounds like a good thing, right? Oh wait, you got... Oh well. Stealth, magic, combat, general. Okay, speak with Curtis. Hey, you got fast travel in this game. And the map isn't that big. Okay, can I steal all your stuff though? Ooh, I, I took it, I took it. I took your stuff. Whatever it was, I took it. This is what we look like now. Guess we can't look ourselves in the face. Take all of our things. If this is like Skyrim, you gotta take all them things and sell them for money. Can't look in the barrels. Oh wow, look at me, I'm so sexy. There, awake at last, I see. It's good to see you up and about. This is the Guild Hall of the Champions of Tyreus. And I am Perdis, and I bid you welcome. It's very buckety. What happened at Heronmar? I wish I knew some sort of dark magic was at work. Both armies were entirely wiped out. You alone survived, and that is the most curious thing of all. I fear that whatever caused the destruction at Heronmar isn't finished yet. You may be the key to unraveling this mystery. Any news of the Dark Elves? Uh, with both armies devastated, the war is over, at least for now. Last we heard, the few remaining Dark Elves had retreated into the, a network of tunnels beneath the ruins of Heronmar. The numbers are greatly diminished, but Prince Solarin still leads them. I need some equipment. Yes, of course. I have a sword and some armor for you here. Here's some gold pieces as well, to buy anything else you may need. The blacksmith, Donner, will welcome your business. When you're ready to solve this mystery, return to me here. Money, money, money. Nice. Thank you, Pardis. Let's put it on. I said, let's put it on. Oh, looks pretty nice. Huh? Ah, hand stuff. Okay. I'm just gonna borrow all of these. Hmm. Just in case they're worth something. If they're not, you know, you'll have them back. You're going to. <laughs> did I stumble? Why did I stumble? Can I have this shield? No. You have so many. Oh. M to overlay. Map overlay. Oh. Thank you. Uh, 
Also, this is not how you build a house, by the way. Can't go in there. I mean, I don't know how to build houses, but I do know that you don't put them in, like, bookity. Now, I have to test this. Is there a quick save in this game? There is not a quick save. Okay. If this is like Skyrim... <laughs> not like Skyrim. I can keep chickens. You don't mind if I kill the chicken, do you? I bid you welcome. Got berries and chickens and pork and mutton and steak. I don't need your food. I have my own chicken legs now. Hello. than I have. Ah, uh, yeah, that would be so typical. Hello, peasant. Oh god, what happened to your eye? Greeting, citizen. How can I assist you? Merchants and shops throughout the city. The Archmage's Tower and the City Council Hall are near the north gate. Most of the guild halls are near the center of town. Visit the guild halls to improve your skills. Be ready to pay, though, training doesn't come cheap. Aven has a long tradition of conflict. I have learned one thing during my years here. When peace comes, it never lasts for long. Oi! Hey, are you done, Nurse Smithy? Greetings, friend. Looking to buy something today? Um, looking to sell something, actually. I hear the Archmage has sealed himself in his tower. I haven't actually heard it, but let's say it anyway. Yes, I heard he's gone mad and refuses to see anyone. People say they hear strange noises and see bright flashes of light coming from his tower window. Typical wizard stuff. Wizard's business is a strange beast. I know. Well, things have settled down a little since the war ended. But now the roads have gotten so dangerous I'm having trouble getting materials. I had a shipment of iron ingots that were supposed to be delivered yesterday, but it went missing somewhere in the eastern forest. Uh, I'll see if I can locate the missing shipment, because I am a hero. Well, thank you, sir. That would be very helpful to me. Now, can I sell you my goblets and stuff? Oh, wow, they're worth quite a bit. the iron dagger or anything like that yet just in case lemon fitty oh my god you got expensive stuff mate guess I want to buy this shield though I um, mean okay It takes a while to get used to the buttons. This is such a me game? This is too bad for me game. This is a, a Tom game, really. No, Ghibli, don't do it! Also, we have a very many snow. A very many snow. Okay, let's go talk to what's his face. Uh, uh, uh. Parkour! Uh. 
It was for the greater good. Greetings, friend. Greetings, friend. How can we learn more about the battle at Heronmar? I would send you to the Archmage, but since he is unreachable, we'll try someone else. There is a wizard named Lamil, and people say he was once the apprentice to the Archmage. Perhaps he can help advise you or give you a way to reach the Archmage. Lamil lives alone in the Eastern Forest. I expect you'll find him there. Just head out the East Gate and look for his cabin. Oh, who pushed me? See if we can find more quests. Bows and more. Pure brews. It's either an alchemist shop or a tavern. Maybe this guy has a quest for me too. Stop pushing me inside. Save hey, game. Good morrow, sir. Seriously, don't build your house on a slope like this. It can't be nice to live in. Especially for an old man like you. Jeez. Greetings, friend. Oh my god. You have a hole in your mouth. Goodbye. That will spar me for life, that will. Can I steal his stuff or is that stealing? Oh, it's a red one. Here, I think it actually means that it's stealing. What else do we have? Strong Arm Tavern. Wait, there's a house? Rebecca's house. She doesn't want visitors. What's with this lens flare? Come on. Well, this is a good design. Jeez. Uh, Can't get up the street, you know. Need a lock. have a jail in this game when you lock big stuff. I bet this is going to be my house. Uh, I can't look down at the bed. I can't this is the furthest down I can look. Greetings, friend. Greetings. Everyone around here calls me Silas. Nice. Sorry, bro. Yes, there's really nothing here. Because this game doesn't have a quick save button, I'm gonna forget. You can use your stealth skill to approach enemies unseen or attempt to steal items undetected. Press X to follow sneak. I am now hidden. Oh, I am also extremely slow. I'm no longer hidden.
<laughs> what a stupid dude. Just this one, then we can move on. It does give experience after all. Lead to the led to the northeast. Nice campsite you got there. Thank you. I pitched it myself. Uh. Athletic shorty hyena. <laughs> I'm gonna look at it later when I have the chance. Southeast, though, not northeast. Oh, there is a weight limit actually. I just saw it in the corner of my eye. Why do I have this game? I have to play it though because you know in my inventory I need to complete it now that I started it especially. Wait, I ate the bread? I didn't eat the bread. I didn't decide to eat the bread. You can't tell me to eat bread if I don't want to eat the bread game. What the hell is that? You don't put a cauldron on top of your house?
Watch me get stuck. Yeah. Okay, that that the cauldron. Let's not go in oh. that cauldron. Hey, you there? Hey. I'm over here. Inside the bottle. I am Lamel the Great, at your service. I am the former apprentice to the Archmage himself, and I wield amazing powers of sorcery. Well, if they were that amazing, you wouldn't be sitting in a bottle, would you? Uh, former apprentice, what happened? There was a small incident involving a frog and a five-legged goat, but you need not concern yourself with that. Oh, you are a powerful wizard. Well, of course I'm power I'm a powerful wizard, you ignorant fop. How else do you think one ends up extraordinarily small, living inside a bottle? Uh, well, I need your assist- Ah, oh, that's excellent news. I would be happy to assist you, but I seem to have gotten myself into a bit of a pickle, a uh, bottle. If you were to first assist me in getting out of here and reversing this spell, then I would be indebted to you. Okay, what do I need to do? On the edge of the forest, you'll find the entrance to a large cave system. Journey through the cave until you find a tunnel that leads into an isolated valley. <clears throat> Take a small vial and fill it with the water from the pools that you find there. The water contains magic left from the old days, and it should be enough to cancel the effects of my spell. The caverns are in inhabited by trolls, but you look able to handle yourself. I'll be waiting here for your return. How can you give me this vial? Okay, I'll be back soon. I should hope so. Why did I see this other Oh, was it me? Oh, it was probably me. Can I climb ladders? Oh! I can climb ladders. Oh. Ow! Game is revolutionary. Really? You know what? There's no way to crouch. Ouch, my legs! Okay, let's go look at me of yours then. This place is pretty boring. <laughs> Get it, get it, boring. Uh... <laughs> Why does the map always disappear? Just because I'm looting doesn't mean I don't want to look at my map, too. Oh, hey, there's a goblin. Hello, goblin. Ah! Friends. Uh, if he's standing under me, then that's cheating because I can't look under me. now then, huh game? Eat. Uh, no, I want to eat. Eat the goddamn bread! Defense <sighs> 20. Defense 15. I'm not gonna eat the bread, is he? Because I want him to eat the bread now. Quick bread in mouth. 
That's how it usually goes, like... The bread in the mouth. Can't pick these mushrooms. What kind of game is it? Where they make big mushrooms and you can't even pick them, huh? Bad game, that's what it is. A bad, bad game. <laughs> God, you can block as well. <laughs> How fast am I gonna feel myself? I'm stopped in shields. top of him. That's cheating. up everything I want. Four 
construction. Sure, why not? Get more money for my fighting. I have all this. I'll be using a bow, but just in case, I'm gonna save it. Mm. Um, damage 17. Greetings, friend. Looking to buy something today? I ate chicken meat. Can I die? I found those iron ingots you were looking for if I eat the raw chicken. Great work, my friend. Here's your reward. Thank you. Bye. Do I have... Can I really eat raw meat? Like, that doesn't... Found very healthy. You know what I mean? This way, pretty much. I'm gonna sell them. I can always go kill more boars. I mean, they do respawn. Hello. Sell the dagger as well. I'm never gonna use the dagger. 
That much I know. Oh, sir. Okay, let's look at the map then. Goblin ruins, please. Yeah. What did you say that we needed to do? Quest. Uh, collect one vial of water. You know, beyond the troll caves. Where's the troll caves, though? Strong. You didn't even have loot? How dare they? That, that I would be oh. I, I would be playing shitty games so you guys don't have to play the shitty games <laughs> and here we are I'm playing a shitty game <sighs> Ah! 
At least this game has music though. Unlike we are the dwarves. <laughs> oh god. That other screen. That is a screen that has some big stuff. It does. The problem with the first person view is I can't see down on, I can't look down on my feet. So I can't really see where people are and stuff. Ew, she's spitting this water. Ew, nasty. <laughs> I deserve a good game, damn it. Oh, hey! They gave me a shortcut. drown you with this water, man. You should be careful what you asked for. Ah, it's <sighs> much better. Oh god, look at this trippy eyes. Well, what can I help you with? I am in your debt, adventurer. about the Battle of Heronmar. Yes, the great victory that killed thousands and has driven the Archmage into a state of madness. The Archmage was getting desperate to the end of the end of the war. He cast a powerful spell with the help of his apprentice, Kavanaugh. I believe they opened a portal to the Shadowlands, hoping to destroy the Dark Elven army, but something went wrong and the forces of Tyrius were killed as well. I don't even know. Did you know? Are you some sort of wizard yourself? You look rather ordinary. Now that I look close, you almost seem familiar to me. Something about the set of your jaw. Perhaps there is something special about you that enabled you to survive. Only the Archmage could tell you more. I say, I think I said, how did I survive the battle? Uh, what are the Shadowlands? They are the dark realms that lie beyond the veil of our world. The Shadowlands are inhabited by foul demons and terrible beasts that thrive on death and destruction. More than anything else, they desire to feed on the souls of the living. If such a creature were loosened in, uh, loosed in our world, it would be a very dark time for Tyrius. Uh, uh, tell me more about Kavanaugh. Kavanaugh is the Archmage's current apprentice. He took my place after I turned the Archmage's pet frog into a five-legged goat. This day, I am certain that Kavanaugh secretly swapped out some of my spell ingredients. I never trusted that one. He is ambitious and conniving. I believe he fancies himself as the future Archmage. Huh? I need to speak to the Archmage. I will do what I can, since I owe you a debt, and the wizard always pays his debts. Uh, I have a letter that the Archmage gave me long ago. It bears his seal and empowers the bear to special privileges. 
I will also give you a token of rune magic. I see a dark path ahead of you, and it may be useful. Uh, okay, bye. Teleportation! I'm gonna travel right now. Can I now travel? At least it's on like one button to save the game. Hello. Well, two, I guess. Go to Donner Donner Smithy. Greetings from Uh huh. Trade. Long sword. Wait, what do I have? I have iron long sword. That's twelve to thirty seven. Once we sell everything else, <sighs> equip this and quick this on the one. Get this. Greetings, friend. I have a fancy hat. I will get more money anyway. I look spiffy. Uh, enter the Tower of the Archmage. Hey, look, 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 there's a girl. She wasn't there before. Hello, kind sir. If you could spare a moment, I beg you to help me. What do you need? My son is sick. I need to fetch some medicine for him. You do watch him while I'm away. It won't take long. Yeah, sure. I can help. Follow me. My house is just around the bend. Ooh, I bet she doesn't have a son. I bet she really doesn't have a son. Just. Well, boys, looks like our honey brought us a bee. I knew it! I knew it! Bad, Rebecca, bad! You're 
you're a very bad Rebecca. Thank goodness you're alive. I am so sorry. This man threatened my life. I had no choice. You disgust me. I will report your actions to the city guard. I beg your forgiveness, sir. I did what I had to do. I don't believe that. You could have said, hello, there are some guys in my house. They're trying to kill me. Ugh. They want you to go in there. And... That's what you could have said. But no, you didn't. Did you? You did not. And now, you must pay. Oh. That is apparently it done. He was a fool and a coward. He sure was a fool and a coward. Don't trust Rebecca. She doesn't have a son. Yeah. 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 Hey, jail person. Jail guard, whatever. Rebecca tried to fool me. Jailer. Be on your way. I have work to do. Face is melting. Told you. Told you, don't trust Rebecca's. Rebecca's are all evil. They try to pretend they have sons just so they can rob you. <laughs> Look at his face. That's <laughs> derpy. Oh, I haven't sat. But he has spiffy hats. Got spiffy hats. Welcome, sir. I am a man of many hats. That you are. God, look at this one. Jester's hat. You have many fine hats, sir. <gasps> I know, right? They change it to Becky. Oh, I'm. Becky, I'm not Rebecca at all. You can trust me. Just Becky. Welcome, sir. Welcome. Oh. I guess I can get a house and decorate my own house, I guess. What's your mark? Bigger on the outside, I mean, I guess. Welcome, friend. That bread. Yeah, I never expected that either, but, I mean, I guess if it's supposed to be a Skyrim- Ah! Knock off! Oh, I don't even have to press space, I can just double click. Oh, let's go to Lady Katrias. Oh, Lady Katrins. Great arrow. Fine steel. Mm. 
You must help me. I heard a noise upstairs. Someone is robbing my house. Right, I will investigate. There's a window that leads to the roof. I left it unlocked. I'm sure the intruder came in through, in through there. Also, she's a very, very echoey. Um, this is upstairs and I see nothing. Oh my god. Suddenly, this game became a platformer. <gasps> oh, Steve has no worries. You know, he can just stand there. <laughs> Phineas. Surprises actually now. A house, and I can walk, you know, across the ropes and stuff. Did you find the robber? I found and killed him. You have done a great service for me. Thank you. Bye bye. I am now respected, I think. Please. Ah, yes, I'm respected. Got all fast learner, all good fortune. I'm bad. Don't get me wrong, this game is still shit, just so you know. Welcome. What can I do for you? Uh, train. I can train. Melee rating when using blunt weapons. Your skill rating when parrying during combat. I don't think I need to train. Okay. Oh, that was only one point? Not that not worth Greetings. I am Lady Pelamon. Tell me about House Pelamon. We are a house of merchants and traders. After years of successful ventures, we have become one of the wealthiest families in Avon. We are open to new members, if they prove themselves worthy. Do you seek to join House Pelamon? Yes, I will join. Excellent, I am eager to see you contribute. I know you will prove yourself for House Pelamon. I am ready for a task. So be it. All members of our house value knowledge first and foremost. All power and strength in the world springs from knowledge. Go to Avon Library and read the histories there. I want you to tell me the year in which the legendary King Orin and Queen Beatrice married. Turn to me when you have the answer. God. I don't remember. Uh, I hated in history lessons when you had to like. Did I level up again? No. When you had to remember like dates because I'm so bad at it. Greetings, friends. How can I assist you? You can train too. Powder. Powder, I guess? I mean, I could at least take one. <sighs> oh, 
Okay, let's go to the library. Ooh, a large hole. All the creature in. Finger, there's a lot of stuff here. Oh, God. Oh, that looks like a shiny book. Uh, parkour. Uh, okay, let's look at this book then. Uh, the first time I heard the story, it was in a song. The singer's words escaped me now, but his tune was sad and quiet, and in a lute it sounded like a faraway echo older than the Raven Hills. The story has stayed with me through the years, perhaps because I told it often to my children, then again to their children. Memory kept alive by the look of wonder and sadness in their eyes. I have no talent for music, so I always tell it as a tale. That is fine. Uh, a romance like that of Beatrice and King Orin carries some melody, and it doesn't need a to cry. As far as anyone can remember, Beatrice has always been in Avon. There are folks who tell stories they heard from their great-great-grandparents about the day she arrived in town. A healer's pack slung from her shoulders. A uh, golden tress is held up with bone pins, a simple dress dusty from the dry road. Others say that her house simply appeared by the square one day, rippling from nothingness as if conjured by a powerful mage. But those were ancient tales. Everyone who knew had been born under her watch. She had fixed her childhood cuts and broken bones, and comforted the sick during plagues. We knew she would be there in our final hours, kissing our passage into the next world, as young and beautiful as when she brought us into the he was found by hunters, crumpled in a deep ravine south of Avon, one foot dipped in the murky water of a cold creek. It had been weeks since anyone had ventured outside of town, but with giant rats, boars and goblins that roamed the countryside. So we needed the sheep for milk and could no longer could no longer the bear taste of rat meat, so we assembled a band of brave folk, track a deer her that wandered past the southern gate. There was a gash on his forehead, and his side bled from a jagged wound right under his ribs. But he still lived. But his lips still. <clears throat> his chest trembling with every shallow breath. Men made a stretcher from vines and pine branches and carried him up the road, through the town gate, and right to Beatrice's doorstep. She was waiting outside, as if she knew he were coming all along. She organ. Re she. <laughs> she recognized him immediately, of course. Prince Orin, heir to the throne, lost in his twelfth year during a goblin raid. His disappearance had killed the queen and driven the king mad. In desperation, he'd made a deal with the demon lord and brought despair to our town. Folks didn't know any of this at the time, of course. Beatrice kept the stranger's identity a secret, mindful of the prophecies that spoke of Avon's liberation at the hand of one who did not know himself. Her task was clear. She would help this young man fulfill his destiny gave him food and a magical medallion that would bring him back to her if he ever fell in battle. With a nod and a knowing smile, she sent him out into the wild world. If he were ever to wield the raven sword and defeat the demon lord, he would have to grow from a hero. He came back to her often at first. He was inexperienced and weak, but as he pushed further into the wild, he became a formidable warrior. It would be weeks before he would reappear, battered and bloody, mumbling about the encounter that left him close to death. A lizard warrior, a troll, a minor demon. He would recover in a matter of hours, and as her magical salves took effect, they would talk. His memory loss, everything was new for Orin. The town, the giant, gnarled trees in the forest, the ruined castle by the river. His enthusiasm and drive were boundless. He had many questions, and always Beatrice was careful to reveal only so much. The prophecy had said that Avon's hero would have to find himself. Beatrice had great respect for prophecies. She was old enough to have seen many fulfilled. Had only she been as careful with her own heart, their story would have been a different one. Beatrice had never married. There had been a few romances, some with mortals, others with endless beings like herself. Once an awkward young mage, eager for power, had told her he loved her. But Beatrice had always been very guarded, careful. Her nature made her keenly em empathetic, tuned in as it were. 
She often knew about people's feelings before they became aware of them themselves. Perhaps because of this, his lost memory, though, Orin was a mystery. They would talk for hours as he recovered from the injuries. Beatrice found herself drawn to him, like an adventurer poised before a dark cave. In some ways, he reminded her of his father, before the demon, the steely determination, the kindness in his smile. But Orin was vulnerable, well, vulnerable in ways that the king had never been. There was a bruise in his heart, a tender spot, and Beatrice felt compelled to soothe it. The 140th year of ancient age, King Orin and Lady Beatrice were married. Hey, Pads! Welcome back! I mean, welcome back! Hello! 104. This is uh, Ravensword Shadowlands. A uh, very strange and bad RPG. But I think was a phone port originally. In a phone game. 104, 104, remember 104. 104. Greetings. I know. King Orton and Lady Beatrice married in the 104th year of the Ancient Age. Excellent! I grant you a small reward for your efforts. Now it is time for a more difficult challenge. I am ready for the next challenge. Very well. I hope you're prepared for a journey. A merchant ran aground just off the coast of the terraces south of Avon. The crew abandoned the ship, but some of the cargo was left aboard. One item which was left behind is a family heirloom of House Pelamon. It is an amulet that belonged to my father. I want you to find the shipwreck and recover the amulet. Turn to me when once you find it. I shall reward you greatly. Okay. This is worse than two worlds. Uh, I mean, look at this. Uh, 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 uh. Look at this. It's supposed. It's like. Looks like to me like. Um, it's supposed to be like an Elder Scrolls like game. But you know. Welcome, friend. Just got the same meat that I already got myself. Except you can kill chickens in this game. Uh, uh. Nothing here. I think it is. I think this is a mobile game. I'm not entirely sure, but I think I read something like it. Hey, look, it's a house. Need a lockpick. They have fancy hats in this game, though. Stay to you. I must attend to my duties. Your duties. Uh, you go attend to your duty. Archmage looked above you. Yes, yes, it's very nice. The Archmage isn't receiving any visitors. Be on your way, citizen. Melty guy face. I have a sealed letter from the Archmage. What's this? I see. It. That is the Archmage's seal. Okay, then you can go inside. Are those supposed to be wolf faces? Why do 
church mages always have such empty houses. Oh, how the gods must revel in their mockery. The archmage, the great protector, become great destroyer. Such folly, such great folly. It is you, the face I have seen in the scry waters. Yes. As the prophecy foretold of the blood and of the blade. Me. I am the survivor of Heronmar. Yes, I heard rumors that someone had survived the destruction I wrought there. Your survival was a great relief to me. If you had died too, then the kingdom of Tyrius would have been lost. Tell me what happened at Heronmar. I was a fool, and my failures are too many to count. With the help of my apprentice, Kavanaugh, I contacted a demon named Ulthok. He is a dark and powerful demon that resides in the realm known as the Shadowlands. In exchange for the souls of the Dark Elves who fought against us, Ulthok agreed to serve me and aid us in the battle. I created a gateway for him to enter our world, but I was betrayed by Kavanaugh. He altered the spell at the last moment. Kavanaugh unchanged the demon from my command and allowed him to enter our world freely. Ulthok devoured the souls of all who fought on the battlefield, including the army of Tyrius. But when something unexpected happened to Ulthok and but then something unexpected happened to Ulthok, and he was forced back through the gateway to Shadowlands. What happened to Ulthok? <clears throat> that puzzled me for some time, so I began to spend long nights searching for, searching the Skywaters for an answer. Then I saw your face, the face of an ancient bloodline that was thought to have ended long ago. You are descended from the great king Orin, who centuries ago wielded the Durada Rail Raven Sword to say a demon lord. Your heritage made you resistant to Ulthok's touch, and the demon wasn't prepared for that. The bargain required that Ulthok take all the souls of those he fought, who fought. When he could not claim you, he was forced back into the Shadowlands. But now Ulthok is gathering his strength, seeking a way to return to Tyrius once and for all. Uh, is this going to be just... I was a fool and my failures are too many to count. Uh, yes, yes. Shouldn't have. That's bad. What happened to Kavanaugh? Kavanaugh disappeared after Ulthok was sent back into the Shadowlands. He has hidden himself using his magic. It seems I greatly underestimated him. I have learned that Kavanaugh is the leader of an underground cult of fanatics determined to bring Ulthok back to in into our realm. He almost succeed succeeded at Heronmar. Ulthok must be destroyed before he finds a way to return. How can Ulthok be destroyed? It is for that task that I need your help. Ulthok cannot be harmed by an ordinary weapon, but he can be slain by the Raven Sword. It is an ancient blade infused with powerful magic. Just as your ancestor wielded it during his time of need, you can wield the Raven Sword to slay Ulthok. The Raven Sword must be found. How can we find the Raven Sword? The Raven Sword was hidden long ago, but I found an ancient text in the Great Library. It spoke of three artifacts called Ravenstones. Gathering the Ravenstones together is the key to finding the hidden location of the Raven Sword. <sighs> Using my magic, I have located one of the Ravenstones. Okay. Where can I find the first Ravenstone? It is in the possession of an ice giant chieftain named Gulch. His lair is far to the north, across the Meadowlands, and within the distant region. Find the Ravenstone and return here. I couldn't even... Come on, Archmage. To aid your efforts, I give you the Rune of Fire. Its warmth and power will serve you well in that frozen place. Thank you. Goodbye. Equip a magic room from inventory. Press R to activate your equipped magic room. Equip. But first, I need to do the other quest. This one.
Yeah, I am an important guy. Because I didn't die. So I get the quest and the thing. <sighs> Hail, citizen. Let me guess, someone stole your sweet roll. be playing this for like 20 more minutes or something. If I completed the dwarf, we are the dwarves today. So I deserve... And I've been playing so much that I haven't even eaten any of... Well, Almost any of my candy that I bought for the candy and chill stream. <laughs> well, come back next week then, Pods. I think I will be doing candy and chill next weekend too. Next Saturday. Uh, wasn't it supposed to be like way south? Well. Hey, rat. Hey, cherry is a big rat. Wait, did I just take a whole rat body? You should eat something every day. Mama. You should eat something every day. Come on, get off the rat! Rat meat. Mm -mm, yummy. That's your dinner for today, Hobinale. <laughs> yummy, yummy rat meat. I mean, this game could be good, you know? I mean, look at it, it doesn't look... No... It could be beautiful and stuff, I guess? How do we get down there without dying? Oh yeah, I am up for the challenge of this game. It is way worse than two worlds though, so... Ah, there we go. Oh, come on. That's a very big rat, actually. But I completed the dwarves. Uh, we are the dwarves. Why do I keep saying the dwarves? It's not the dwarves. The dwarves is a completely different game. <clears throat> I think it was actually even bigger than my guy. What's on this side then? I should have. No, next time I'm gonna level up that. <laughs> Magic! Ooh! Good thing I came back! It's treasure! Uh, we are the dwarves. Uh, it wasn't easy. No. It had very... Well, let's put it like this. It was mostly easy. But then it had like these weird, weird levels where it went like super hard for some reason. And it was like no longer funny. That's how hard it was. It was frustrating me. The controls were the frustrating part, you know. But I did like the game though. Uh, that was good that you had a nap. I guess, deeply. I had a nap earlier today. Very nice. Where 
are we going now? Hey, there's a castle. What's that? Or the tiger. Those seem to be very difficult enemies. I think I will uh, not touch them yet. Well, we were actually killing goblins actively, and trolls. Now we're killing giant rats. And apparently work tigers kick us out. <laughs> I'm sure we can kill the work tigers so you know if we just do it tactically <clears throat> like this This is a different stone. Let's enhance with strength. Oh, it's strength. Can I enhance many times? Yeah, I can. Goes alone for a little bit. Look. Trolls. Oh, giant yeti. or something. We don't need to be up there for the quest. Uh, 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 Who are the 
these stairs made for? <clears throat> I, am I still following the right quest? Yeah, the lost heirloom. got there. See, the quest tells me to go out that way. And I'm not supposed to go out that way, but I'm supposed to go out that way? Make up your mind, game. Let's try the bear. Let's save. And then try to kill the bear. If not, I'll just have to be farming on some... Traveler, I am always eager to trade. Wow, wow, your voice. Wow. Lockpicks. Yeah, sure. Hello, my name is Leah. Hello, Leah. Can I trust you with a secret? Sure, certainly. I must speak quietly so that my father Malcolm does not hear us. Part of the matter is I have fallen in love with a man named Jordan. I wish to be married, but my father has forbidden it. My father has threatened to kill Jordan if he sees me. I will not let my father keep us apart, so I have decided to run away. I need money for traveling. 500 gold pieces should be enough. Can you help me? Uh, yes, I will help you. That is wonderful news. In North Avon, find the Wayward Inn. I will make an excuse to come to the city later today. Meet me at the Wayward Inn with 500 gold pieces. That will be enough to buy passage to the Westlands here. Or Jordan awaits me. Uh, sure. Guess we need to kill more bear. Oh yeah, the voice acting is horrible. Very buckety. But I mean... What do you expect, really? Seems like I was really supposed to be here, but the game was like, no, 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 don't. There. Oh, God. 
god. Can I not eat food? By the way, I'm gonna have to. If I put food on my quick bar, can I eat it? Like, I have this pork. Seems like I can only drop it. But he will occasionally eat it, you know, on his own. Mm. Guess I need like proper potions or something. Giant Yeti. Is that the same as the other one? Well, that's like nice. I'm just sliding across the mountain. Oh well. in endurance talent stuff please. toughness please. I think the bear was easier than this guy but Already? That was fast. <sighs> like, I don't want to be killing goblins all the time, that's no fun. But it's like not a very good game. Roll a YC there. Oh, look at that berry, it has such a fat arse. Okay, that's going to be it actually for today. Um, it's almost nine anyway. Um, I will continue this next week on Saturday, and um, yeah, thank you very much for stopping by, oh, candy and chill, and see you later, bye, thanks for stopping by, okay bye, okay bye, see you later, bye.